Hey everybody! So this video is about cosplaying outside of events like Comic Con or Super Comic City. If you want shots that aren't like con shots, you need to. Is there someone there? Oh, oh some lots of sand! Oh, they're all here. Are you getting them in the background? No. I kind of want them in the background. They're like okay. So if you want location shots, unlike at home, you can't just, hey guys, let's hop in the car and go to Pasadena City Hall. That's not going to work. You need to go to an event that like sets up cosplayers cosplaying at a location. So that's where I'm at today. Currently we're at a giant park and so it has like, you can't tell, but we're in a castle right now. Maybe some like organizations will organize events that take place in public locations. So that's what I'm at right now. And it's actually a local one. So I wanted to try it. So here you can sort of see like what the park looks like. I don't know what the heck this park is, but the park has like a tropical garden and it has like a castle, like this this nonsense. So yeah. So basically cosplayers can come and cosplay in public at this park. Basically the way it works is just like any sort of other event. You'll come, you'll check in, and you'll change at the location, and then leave your stuff, come out, change out before you leave. So sometimes for these events only cosplayers will be like at the event, but for this one it's like we're cosplaying around normal people. So to be honest, I find it a little bit uncomfortable, especially since like it's pounded into you like cosplay in public is dame 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 desu. So I don't know, and I just feel like I stand out even more because you know, not Japanese. Now I'm in costume in public. Oh, I'm doing something so incredibly like wrong right now. Forgive me. Oh, I didn't see you there. So check this out so here's like more of like where we're at and so apparently there's an aquarium in here and so you can also shoot at the aquarium so these sorts of events are really good if you want to have a photo shoot at like the particular location so like if you are i don't know like penguin drum or something it's perfect to shoot in the aquarium right so great but like if you're going to try and meet some people not so good like this park is so big and there's like such a small amount of cosplayers that like we could we're here and they could never find us like actually because some people are in the aquarium some people are like oh some is over there i'm in here wherever the heck this is so i definitely suggest coming to these sorts of events and looking for these sorts of events on Cosplayers Archive. If you come to Japan with a photographer, so you and your buddies plan a Japan trip, definitely recommend. If you're just looking to cosplay and sort of like put yourself out there, definitely go to a doujinshi event. But if you want a photo shoot, consider it. But remember, it's a little awkward. It's a little awkward. So here is the area where the check-in and the changing rooms are. So at this sort of event, or actually any sort of event, you will get like this sort of like badge. So this one is for like that you have like permission to use the dressing room and stuff. Like one event I had like a wristband. And you're just supposed to have it just so that they know that like one, you can like use the changing rooms like you paid. And then two, that like you have permission to be there. Don't lose your junk. And so now, since it's it's raining, so I'm just gonna change out. I'm gonna go eat. I'm hungry, and it's cold and it's raining. Okay. It is about. I burped. <laughs> okay.